This video is brought to you by TS4U IT Engineering Bootcamp. Are you looking for an IT bootcamp? In your journey with TS4U, you will get workshops and tasks every week. Hands-on practice, technical tests and tasks, show and tell, mock interview. And we get paid fully only when you get a job. You can get affordable student loan. Become eligible for free tuition. We offer industry demanding IT boot camps. Join now and start your IT engineering journey today with TS4U. So tell me, why would you choose REST Assured over Postman to automate RESTful um, services? Okay, so to be honest, actually, I uh, use the Postman also for the API automation. Okay. So uh, earlier of the project, actually, we use the uh, Postman uh, so that we can simply uh, check the APIs and also we can do the manual testing. We can do the also automation because through the Postman, we can do easily. Just simply uh, just click and simply also write down some scripts. Then I can do the automation and I can do I can run those. Uh, but later on, we actually implemented the REST Assured because we saw that in the Postman, we have some limitation. Uh, we can we cannot do a lot of things, like mostly the common things is like the, the programming language. Like uh, in the Postman, it is only supported by the JavaScript. So that means the test scripts and all those things we had to write down, uh, write down through the JavaScript. But I, I was, uh, I'm, I'm not expertise on the JavaScript, but I have some basic knowledge and some actually some of the core knowledge and the basic knowledge of the JavaScript. So by that I could easily write down the functions. But uh, in the REST assured, actually we can have multiple programming language like the Java, uh, Python, Ruby, like all the, by those programming language also we can implement the REST Assured. So there is a, actually the platform independence we can say. Then we can also say the code reusability. So in the Postman, it is very like, uh, uh, we cannot use the, like reuse the code over and over, okay? Uh, but in the REST Assured, obviously it says uh, like, as it is a Java client, so we can easily write down the Java codes. We can easily declare the methods. Then we can easily call those methods. And that means we can reuse the, those codes. And also we can implement the, um, like all the Java things, like the objects, classes, uh, polymorphisms, methods, overloading, overriding, all those things actually we can do before the code reusability. Then uh, another one is like the customized reports. Like, so in the Postman, they have their own reports. Okay, they have just the simple reports. By those reports, we can easily get the time and we can get, it, get the easily the information of the, like which one is, which test is failed, which test is passed. But in the rest assured, we can actually implement the third party, uh, like reporting, like I use the LU reporting. And by using that LU reporting, we can actually customize the reporting and we can get the information. We can uh, actually choose the specific reports and specific data. So it is, as it is the open source, so we can actually manipulate the uh, like data uh, reports easily. Then the designing the data driven framework. So uh, for the postman, like we have the collection runner and we can provide only with one data file for each collection. Okay, like, uh, the, like there is a collection and inside that collection I can, if I want to do the data driven, so I can just pass only one file with that, with that collection. But in the rest assured, we can actually, um, we can add or we can implement multiple uh, data driven as I implemented the Cucumber BDD also. I followed the BDD approach. So there uh, I simply I can also implement the data driven testing on the uh, uh, feature file and the step definition class. So just simply add the scenario outline and, and the examples keyword and then bring all the test data and just simply can run the data driven testing there. Then another one, I can say the um, uh, CICD integration. So the CICD integration is uh, like, um, we can uh, like integrate both to like any CI tool into the Postman and the uh, uh, REST Assured. 
So for the postman, we have to use the new mans. Okay, by using the new man, new man is a command line tool, and by using that tool, actually we can run the uh, collection through the uh, we can run the collection into the terminal or into the any into the Jenkins also. But for the rest assured, we can actually uh, we can also like provide the information, all the things uh, like the project information and then the command line, like the maven commands, which one need to run, which one need to execute. We can put all those information to implement the CI CD. So these are the mostly common uh, like advantage or disadvantage or the differences we can say between the rest assured and the postman. Uh, I can say, and for this reason, actually, uh, for these advantages in uh, Postman, we actually then later on, we implemented the REST issue to automate the APIs.